Skincare is actually really important in achieving this look because you want to take care of your skin so you don't have to put much foundation and that's just going to cover up all that natural glow in your skin. So <clears throat> I'm going to run you through some of my skincare routine. First thing first is cleanser. I always cleanse the night before. I don't cleanse in the morning because your skin produces natural oils in the morning and cleansing the night before allows you to basically clean up all the dirt that you have sitting on your skin so cleaning it the night before and then when you wake up it's like you have clean skin and natural oil on your face if you cleanse again in the morning your skin might overproduce the natural oils and that would not be good so i usually cleanse at night i don't cleanse in the morning okay next is toner so right now i'm just going to put on my toner so i am using the shiseido white loosen toner and since i don't cleanse in the morning i use the toner to just refresh my skin uh, wipe off any dust or dirt that might be sitting on my skin um, after you know sleeping i will move on to this shiseido altimune uh, power infusing serum so what this altimune does it is that it acts as a booster to your skin so that anything that you put on um, it just kind of helps it it just kind of enhances it even more okay. so once that's done i would use another serum on my skin which is the shiseido white lucent luminizing surge so what this is is actually it's meant to it's a serum that kind of lightens your pigmentation, um, freckles, or acne scars. So yeah, I use this to just kind of prevent freckles because I kind of already have some freckles and um, I use it to kind of prevent any of that from happening. Next is moisturizer. Now moisturizer is really important as well. I have really dry to combination skin and it's leaning towards dry skin so I really need to moisturize my face to give me that healthy glow okay so once that's done you can already kind of see that my skin is just starting to look a little bit glowy from all the skincare that I've put on finally I am going to put sunscreen sunscreen is actually really important especially when you have weather like mine in Malaysia and it's really hot here and it's really important to use sunscreen I never used sunscreen when I was younger but um, sunscreen is really important when it comes to like preventing um, your skin from aging keeps the skin young, it protects it from the sun or any UV rays. Now that I've done with my skincare, I am going to put a luminizing primer. So I am using the Shiseido Glow Enhancing Primer. This is the only one that I have and um, I know all my skincare and stuff are like Shiseido but it's only because I work there. So I'm just going to put primer on my face. Now, once that's done, I am now going to conceal some of my dark circles. So the way that I'm going to do this is that I'm going to use a brush and I'm just going to spot correct my under eye. Spot right here, use the side to just 
blend it out. Okay. So, again, concealer on one end. Just pat it on your dark circles. Flip it to the other end and then just blend it with the other end. Now for foundation, I am going to use the NARS Radiant Tinted Moisturizer. I'm using this because I don't want a full coverage foundation, I just want like a tinted uh, glow on my skin. So I'm just going to put a tiny bit because we don't want to cover our face with foundation. And I'm just going to dip it in a brush. Starting from the outside because I don't want to cover that glow that's happening right in the middle here. I'm just going to start from the outside. So basically once you feel like that's not much on your brush anymore, you just kind of want to move your way in. I still have like excess foundation on my hand here and I don't even need that much so I'm just gonna wipe that off okay so that is your skin done I'm just going to cover a bit around my nose some redness around my nose so I'm just going to use the same method of concealing on my nose So that's done. So the trick to this whole skin look is minimum, very minimum foundation, spot correct on any blemishes that you might have or redness um, around the skin. If you have really oily skin, I would suggest powdering just on that spot that you want to cover up, but don't powder your whole face. I personally have dry skin, so I don't really need to powder my face. Now for the brows, I'm just going to roughly just do my brows. I'm just going to brush them out. I'm just going to give myself a really natural brow look. And there you have it. Um, glass 